What's going on everyone? Welcome back to another video. I'm Michigan Sports Talk here and Michigan may be landing another key offensive lineman in the 2024 class as Jake Guarnera is set to decide on April 28th. Gonna be talking about him, where Michigan stands, plus where Michigan stands with other top key targets, as well as what recruits have to say about their visits to Michigan and also Michigan currently recruiting the number one, number two, and number three ranked quarterbacks in the 2025 class going to be going over all that and more in this video so let's go ahead and get right into it all right so we're going to go ahead and dive right into it here first thing i want to talk about is the 2024 three-star offensive lineman Jake Guarnera. He's an interior offensive lineman. He's 6'3 and a half, 290 pounds. Comes from the state of Florida. And right now, Michigan has two crystal ball predictions going in their favor to land him. He plans to uh, make a verbal commitment, which will be on April 28th. And right now, Michigan is in the top five alongside Florida and North Carolina State, Rutgers, and Penn State. And not only does Michigan have two crystal ball predictions going in their favor, but also according to the recruiting prediction machine on On3, Michigan has a 89.3% chance to land him. This will be another huge pickup at the offensive line position. Michigan already has commitments from four-star offensive tackle Andrew Sprague, four-star interior offensive lineman Luke Hamilton, and also three-star offensive tackle Ben Roebuck. So Jake Guarnera, the three-star interior your offensive lineman will decide on April 28th. And I also want to talk about other offensive linemen that Michigan is trending for right now. We obviously uh, just got a commitment from four-star offensive tackle Andrew Sprague over the weekend. But another guy Michigan is trending for is the four-star offensive tackle Blake Frazier from the state of Texas. Michigan has five crystal ball predictions going in their favor. I definitely think Michigan will land him. And another guy who has a crystal ball prediction going in Michigan's favor right now is the four-star offensive tackle Max Anderson, also from the state of Texas. There's also other guys like the number one offensive tackle in the 2024 class, Brandon Baker. Also the number five offensive tackle, Bennett Warren and uh, Michael Uini. So offensive line recruiting right now is going phenomenally for Michigan. Next thing I want to talk about is the 2025 five-star on 24-7 sports composite rankings uh, linebacker Noah McHale. Comes from the state of California. He's 6'3", 205 pounds. And Michigan actually just uh, hosted him for a first ever visit. Michigan seems to be just getting in his recruitment. Uh, he is from the class of 2025. So and he took a multi-day trip to Michigan. He's from California. So that's a long trip. And Mikhail told on three in the Wolverine that Ann Arbor seems like a great place. Being able to go there and see everything. Getting to sit down with Coach Partridge, which is Michigan's newest linebackers coach. He said that was great and also meeting coach Harbaugh. He said that him and Chris Partridge uh, just started talking about a week or two before he took the visit and talking about Jim Harbaugh. He said for him to be who he is with his background is obviously intriguing to see his success as a coach as well as the developing of his players. Also talking about Michigan strength coach Ben Herbert. He said learning about what he does with the players is crazy. Playing at the top and getting the max potential out of you is what it's all about. Now Mikhail is also set to visit USC, Miami, and Florida this month. And uh, he may look to return to Michigan sometime this fall. But it seems like it was a great first visit for the number three ranked linebacker uh, in the class on 2025 on 24-7 sports rankings he's ranked as a uh, four star however the number two linebacker in the class definitely one of the one of the top rated linebackers in the 2025 class i also want to talk about uh, another guy who actually took a visit to michigan's spring game and it's another linebacker in the 2025 class anthony saka he's from philadelphia pennsylvania goes to st joseph's prep school 6'3 225 pounds he's not ranked on 24 7 sports However, on on three industry rankings, he's ranked as a four star, ranked 110th nationally, and he's also ranked as a four star on rivals. Currently, Penn State leads in his recruitment. No surprise there, since he's from Pennsylvania. The Michigan 
could be uh, getting into this recruitment a little bit more. Speaking about his visit uh, to, or yeah, during the spring game, he told on three in the Wolverine, it was a great time. I had a lot of fun. Said I had a great time with the coaches. I met and had some great conversations with all of them. He said, I definitely love the stadium. It was exciting to see it for the first time. Talking about the linebackers at the spring game, he said, I thought they had a good scheme defensively. I was obviously rooting for Chris Partridge's team. Now, the spring game visit also gave Saka an opportunity to talk to Michigan linebackers coach Chris Partridge for the first time. And Saka said it was good to talk to him. I talked to him for about an, a half an hour. And he said we connected really well. Coming out of the visit, he said, I'm definitely liking Michigan a lot. He said when it comes down to cutting my schools, they'll be there. So clearly, Anthony Saka had a great spring game visit with Michigan getting to meet coach Chris Partridge for the first time. And the next thing I want to talk about is the Michigan quarterback recruiting right now. Obviously, Michigan landed five-star uh, quarterback in the 2024 class, Jaden Davis. But in the 2025 class, Michigan is going after the number one, the number two, and the number three quarterbacks in the class. That includes the number one ranked quarterback, Bryce Underwood, the number two ranked quarterback, Cutter Bowley, and the number three quarterback in the class out of George McIntree. Bryce Underwood is obviously from Belleville, Michigan, uh, and he's a five-star number one ranked quarterback. And recently, George McIntree was seen throwing a football in Michigan gear. And according to the Michigan Insider, Sam Webb actually talked to Jaden Davis's dad, uh, Jeremiah Davis, and he asked what was up with the Brace Underwood kid as Jaden Davis just committed to Michigan. And Jeremiah Davis actually uh, said that he hopes Michigan gets him. He wants Michigan to have uh, another quarterback, but he also wants there to be competition in the room. So it seems like Jaden Davis and his dad welcoming the competition at the quarterback position. And who knows, getting Jaden Davis might actually help Michigan get Brace Underwood. But right now, the quarterback recruiting for Michigan and Jim Harbaugh is off to a phenomenal start in the 2025 class. And the next guy I want to talk about is the 2024 three-star defensive lineman Dylan Johnson. He comes from the state of Illinois. Wisconsin currently has one crystal ball prediction. That was actually just about six days ago that was put in. But he's an interesting one because he's not only a football player, he's also a very good uh, wrestling player as uh, the 6 foot 2 287 pounder is a three-time Illinois state champion at the heavyweight division also hasn't lost a single match as he has a 100 4 and 0 record but he told on three in the Wolverine about Michigan about his visit in late March that it was really nice this time around because I got to speak with the football coaches and got the chance to see the football facilities said when we were at practice they were having an NFL type draft for their spring game he said in general it looked like the team had a lot of fun together he also said that I think the wrestling program is great and they work hard also talking about uh, defensive line coach Mike Elson, he said we talked a little bit about their D-line, the scheme, where I could fit in that scheme and everything that they try to do. He seemed like a good coach because of everything that he talked about with the position. So uh, Dylan Johnson, Michigan going after him for football and also wrestling. And the last thing I'll talk about is the 2024 four-star defensive lineman. Say Davian Sims from the state of Oklahoma, 6'3", 275 pounds. He's ranked 121st nationally on 24-7 sports rankings. And he just named Michigan in his top 10. And he also is apparently planning to make his first ever visit to Michigan, which will be huge. Now, Michigan State was considered to be a heavy favorite. However, they have seen to lost some steam. But Davian Sims planning to make his first ever visit to Michigan. And another guy who's also taking a first ever visit, who is planning to take a first ever visit to Michigan, is the top 100 cornerback in the 2025 class, four star Devin Williams from Buford High School in Georgia. He is Montrez Walker's teammate. Um, that would also be huge in the 2025 class. But other than that, that is going to wrap up today's video. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, make sure you guys go ahead, drop a like, comment down below, and subscribe for more if you are new. I'd really appreciate it. Other than that, hope you guys all have a great rest of your day. We will see you guys in the next video. Peace.